Hi guys, welcome back to Sparky Face 5. Today is a quick video on how I created this mailbag clip thing in Fusion 360 and a prime example of uh, that you should really write your designs down on paper and plan it out first because this took me a lot longer than it should have. It should have only taken 5 or 10 minutes, instead it took me half an hour to 40 minutes. Ridiculous, I know. But first of all, I'd like to give a shout out to some of my patrons. Lauren from A Buzz Design, Spectra 3D, Chuck Hellebuck, Hel Chuck, Chuck Hellebuck, and Bob Camp. Thank you guys, it means a lot to me that you continue to support the channel, and I hope to get some more videos out for you soon. Let's get started. So yeah, I was so psyched to get a few moments to actually jump on the computer and make a model and hopefully 3D print it that I hadn't actually planned what I was doing. So I don't have a pretty tutorial for you today, um, unfortunately. You'll have to just settle for what I've got here, which is a bit of a mess. But I'll, I'll talk you through what I did and hopefully it still makes sense. So one of the first things I did was made a sketch and use the text function to write the letters that I wanted and I had to choose the correct font. I didn't know what I wanted so it took me a while to get to that. Um, then I extruded that font upwards and I drew a rectangle in the back so that I could sort of uh, make a clip that goes over and around the bit of material that will hold it in place. Um, with that I made a I tried a few different things, but what I ended up doing was making a large rectangle and drawing a line across it, and then extruding the small rectangle uh, out to the back, and then the large rectangle um, at an offset to the back. Verbally, this doesn't seem to make sense to me. I hope it makes sense to you. It sort of looks like a C or a U shape when you look at it from the end on and it clips over a piece of material on my mail organizer. So here we go, I'll, I'll um, finish up with some pictures and hopefully it'll make a little bit more sense after that. Please remember to subscribe to the channel and click the bell button to get notifications for each new video. If you'd like to support me, you can on Patreon, the link is in the description. And uh, I hope you have a great day, happy printing, and check out these other videos. Thanks for watching, ciao!